get in here. Welcome everyone. Here's a rare Yuri Geller watch. This is very difficult to find and it's one of his specialties. And these are really nice again, talking about Yuri Geller. I mean, this is someone we should all um, honor and uh, try and connect to his energies. He's been a proven person. Don't believe all the nonsense scientists have proven his abilities. So let's take a look at this unique watch. Now, we have several watches of his for sale um, that look different. This is one of his rare, very expensive ones that were produced about, I don't know, 20 years ago. You can see his actual signature on here. It says Yuri Geller on there. And it has a very unique case on it. You can see here it's got this like... Um, diamond crystal type case. Now, I've seen this watch recently offered for uh, $10,000 because it's so rare. You just can't find these anymore. And you can see on the side here is another one of these great Yuri Geller things. 1111 Infinity Infinity? Infinity? Um, symbol E equals MC squared. And he puts this on all his watches uh, this is, as I said, a very unique one, and it's a good watch. Uh, keeps good time. Uh, it's got a signature there. It's got the um, date secondhand and this very um, uh, classic look to it that you get with uh, certain watches. So let's see if we can get in there yet again tight. This certainly is a great camera for getting these kind of shots. It's very attractive. It's got, uh, let's pull back a little here. It's got a metal band. You can see here, classic metal kind of cl uh, clip band. So you tuck in and then down, and you can adjust this, of course. Of course, you're not going to find this watch, and we don't have any for sale. This is my personal watch that I generally wear every day. But it has a nice metal links to it. Of course, you could take that off and put anything on in there, but it has that, and you can adjust it to your size. Now, the one nice thing that all of his watches and so forth have, and I don't know why they're not uh, more popular. Uh, I guess he's just uh, from a different time. He was very popular when I was in my teens, and even before me. He was big in the 60s and early 70s, and uh, seemed to fade out after that. But you can see right here... Let me get my hand out of there. Let me put a little... You can see right here. This is a quartz crystal that he has charged. Now, this is in constant contact with your skin, obviously. So that's very nice and a very interesting feature. Now, uh, we have in here, and I'm not sure how much we can see of this... Side there on the back here. Probably not going to be able to see it very well, if at all. Well, it's got his signature on here. What else have we got in here? Let's see this for a second. Um, yeah, it's all very small, and I don't think you're going to be able to see any of it, but let's get in there. But again, his signature again. But the main thing is that you're getting this actual quartz crystal that he has empowered, and that's touching your skin. So you're getting this kind of transfer of energy all the time, which is quite nice. Um, on this side, it's just the adjustable um, for the time here. And of course, we already showed you that as on there already. So this is one of these classic rare, and I think it should be documented like I've documented most of his um, other products, and I'm going to continue to show those to you, uh, which are actual um, from toys to plates uh, to uh, crystal glasses and uh, vases and other things. All of this is quite um, 
nice and super, super rare. But, you know, what better for someone who's into uh, radionic technology, subtle energy physics, uh, to have products of really the only person out there in the last, uh, well, still alive, really. Most of the uh, popular psychics from the 60s and 70s are all dead now. Um, there's really nobody out there doing anything of great interest. They're not making stuff like this or they're cheap junk. Uh, he has also rings and crystals and other things. I think he sold on QVC and other places. Uh, well, these are all nice things to have. Why buy common stuff when you can get something from a master? So I hope everybody's enjoyed a look at this very rare watch of his. And make sure, and I'll have in the link here, uh, make sure you go and check out the watches that we have for sale. These are great presents uh, for Christmas coming up or for any occasion. Um, how cool would it be to give somebody a watch like this? And they're not that expensive. They're high quality. And talk about unusual. Um, if someone needs a watch or some others we, we have, well, this is fantastic instead of getting some of the junk that's out there. And... Um, it certainly is a piece of history and a piece of power. I hope you've enjoyed this. More coming.